All right, guys. Out here this morning, getting rained on. Ended up catching us a nice coyote here, though. This was just kind of like a little uh, walk through two hole set here. Nothing too crazy, just kind of like a flat set there. Got us a nice dog here. Got us a nice one. We're going to get him taken care of and get going, guys. It's raining and I'm getting soaked. Stay with us. Well, there's where we had one of the last coyotes in that RJ set. I went ahead and moved the trap right down to here. I don't think I've had this guy caught too long. It's a really big morcoon there. I'll definitely keep him. But he don't really have anything tore up. I'm pretty sure I could hurry up and get him out of here and uh, get this trap reset. So we're kind of in a hurry today, guys. So we're going to get this guy taken care of and get on down the line. Thanks for coming along. Little big old boy. Hot on that dough. All right. Looky what we got here. This was, uh, I believe this was our dirt hole set. Yeah, because the walkthrough we had is right here behind him. So this would have been a dirt hole with, uh, I believe I used my test bait, a little bait I made up that I'm testing out. And uh, I know I had Beavery Victor and Red Fox number 69 in the hole. And a little bit of earring on the backing. Looks like we got us a nice one though. Right there's that walkthrough we had one in uh, a couple days ago. So yeah guys, we got some nice coyote. Looks like we got a good catch on him. I'm going to go ahead and uh, get this guy taken care of. I probably won't be making remaking this set, but maybe this weekend when I come back out and I got a little extra time, I'll, I'll pop another dirt hole in here. But yeah guys, we're going to get this guy taken care of and get on down the road. Alright, would you looky here? Got us a nice coyote in a flat set. We had a big old mud ball raccoon right there yesterday. It was an RJ set. And I went ahead and pulled the trap because it was so sloppy muddy. But I had just a little flat set right here. And uh, I had uh, my dead end coyote gland lure and a little bit of urine there on that rock. Looks like we went ahead and picked one up. Being a little shy. It's super windy out guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get this guy taken care of, get the set remade and get on down the road. Thanks for coming along. Pulling up to the next location, got us another coyote. That's awesome. Looks like a pretty good one there. That would have been in the remake, uh, right? You can see right in front of him is where that RJ set was. That had that big male in uh, just a couple toes, the last set. So I went ahead and moved the set right there and redid it. We'll go ahead and get this guy taken care of and uh, Get the set remade. All right, guys, it's a windy one this morning. Windy and chilly. Yeah, I just wanted to get a little closer video of this coyote here. He's a pretty good looking dog. So, yeah, we get this set remade and, uh, yeah, I should be able to remake it. We had a raccoon caught there the other day. Nice deep catch there in that MB550. We got us a little pad in there. So, yeah, we're going to quit messing around. We got some more uh, sets to check, and then we'll be getting out of here. All right, guys, out checking some traps here. Um, it's uh, opening day of shotgun season. Come out to check some sets during in between hunts, and uh, we got us a really nice coyote here. This was a step down dirt hole we did. Um, I'll have to look and see what bait and lure I had on it. But uh, I'm not going to be remaking this right now. 
I got another set right there so uh, we'll go ahead and get this guy taken care of and uh, we got some more traps to check and then we gotta get back to deer hunting so stick with us guys